after New MacArthur Cyclones. We're back this week for an amazing edition of Book Talk Tuesday. I'm so excited to introduce you to one of my favorite faculty members here hey. at MacArthur. Can y'all say hi to Miss April Prenty? Hey everyone. Hey Miss Prenty. Miss Prenty is the is a science teacher here at MacArthur. She's actually the chair of the science department right now and She's the cheerleading coach. Woo! Go Cyclones! Go Cyclones! <laughs> and she is also an avid reader. So uh, she told me about this book that she just finished. She said, Miss Long, you have to get this book for the library. Yes. And indeed, we did not have it yet. And after she told me about it, I thought, oh, I I've got to get that. Yeah. So the title is um, Clap When You Land by Elizabeth Acevedo. Um, and it just sounds intriguing. So I'm going to turn the microphone over to Ms. Prunty. Thank you, Mrs. Long. Okay, um, this book is called Clap When You Land, and here's just a little information about it. It's about two sisters who did not know about each other for an entire 16 years. Like, Can you imagine knowing that it's, you have a girl walking around with your face? Um, they share one father. But he split between two countries, so one lives in the United States, Jahara, and Camino lives in the Dominican Republic. So he spends six months after the year with one daughter and then spend the rest of the year with the other one. Now, the girls differ greatly, as you can see um, in the title, the cover of the book. Mm -hmm. There's one who lives in New York City, and she's like the privileged daughter who lives with um, her dad and her mother. Mm. Um, Camino, on the other hand, is pretty much an orphan and being raised by her aunt and gets to see her dad for some months within a year. Uh, Camino is extremely beautiful. She lives by the ocean. She's a little bit more girly, whereas you have Jahira, who is extremely studious, um, <coughs> a great chess player, and has the things she needs to pretty much make it. Um, Camino's dream is actually to go to the United States to a school and become a doctor. Oh, okay. That's awesome, Miss Prenny. And so tell us, so how the girls don't, they grow up, they don't know about each other, correct? No, that's correct. Until something, until the tragedy happens. Okay, yes. The title is called Clap When You Land. And for those of you who fly, understand, once the pilot lands, you always clap to thank him for getting you there safely. They learned about each other because their father was on his way to see Camino, but never made it because their plane went down. Mm. And um, mm. that's when Jahira figured there was an issue um, with the death of her father because it was taking too long to get the body back and the mom's mm. actions. So. Wow, I cannot, I cannot imagine having a si finding out I had a sibling, right. you know, as a sixteen-year-old that I never even knew about. That's just incredible. 16. Wow. Well, it sounds really intriguing. Oh, and Miss Prenny, one more thing. Would you tell them the style of the book? It's written kind of a big poem? Yeah, or? it's, um, well, <laughs> now, the um, the way the book is written, it's written so well that you can see what's happening. Um, each girl has their own chapter. So you will hear, um, hear from Camino's perspective, and then you will hear a chapter from Jahira's perspective. But it is um, poetic. So you'll have to slow down and actually try to read this book to understand what the author is trying to get you, like what the message is trying to be portrayed. And I thought this was so neat because, you know, April is National History, I mean, National Poetry Month, and Miss Prenny's first name is yes. April. April showers brings May flowers. <laughs> <laughs> and awesome book talks. Let's yes. give Miss Prenny a round of applause. Thank Good job, Miss Prenny. You guys come on the, by the library, check out Clap When You Land by Elizabeth Acevedo, and we'll see you soon. See ya. <laughs> Bye.